Hey, I just needed to show you this awesome game. Okay, so I'm just in this little ship here. And I found this huge ship. So I looked at it and Docking I, granted. Nomad Vanguard. Let's see, Please see if I can dock. We will be scanning your inventory. Docking granted. Okay, cool. So you can land on these ships. That's fun. You can go now. This big ship, it goes on its own missions. Does its own things, and it's actually very impressive. So let's go over here. So I'm just gonna land on it. Landing is cool. It's like a little video game in a way. A little mini game. Successfully docked. Alright, so now I'm on this ship and I don't know who these people are. I think they're like miners or something. And there's my ship. And let's just go explore. I'll show you the coolest parts first. Let's go to the bridge. Alright, so we'll go here. So here are the people commanding the ship. Hello there. Um, you can have this ship. Uh, well, not this one. I mean, unless you have another, like, attack ship to take this one over and get some marines, like this guy. And you can storm in and, and uh, do some killing if you want. You can be a pirate. You can do whatever you want. My ship's over there, I think. That's where I was a minute ago. And there's a big space station way over there that I'm about to go to. And you'll just be hanging out in here, and suddenly the ship will start um, going on its own mission with its own goals. And it's part of a faction that's like sending its people out to mine or something. There's, there's a few factions. There's like about 15 factions, and they're just doing different things and having like uh, military influence or like economic influence and political stuff too. They're building big space stations. You can build big space stations too and customize them and make them bigger than that. This game's almost limitless. It's just very complicated and so cool. So they'll be here for who knows how long, but they're probably going to send out some like uh, robots to go mine this big rock here. I don't know who these people are, but they better watch out for that rock, by the way. Alright, well they'll figure it out. And yeah, all these people, they're doing stuff. Like, this guy's the pilot, this guy's doing, like, scanning this person's navigation or weapons or something. That rock disappeared. And then, this is cool, let's go to crew quarters. Alright, so, this is where the crew hangs out. I saw a guy in here earlier just sort of chilling right here, like, with his elbow on the table. And I guess they can, I don't know, cook. Reading corner. Let's look at something else. So. Let's go to the brig. Which is jail. And here it is. You have a guard. So, no one's in here right now, but I assume that this is actually functional. And since you're... I think you collect bounties in this game, too, if you want to. There, I just opened that. That's awesome. You can collect bounties, and um, I guess you would, you know, capture someone and throw them in there. Or if you're, you know, someone who's mean, you'd capture anybody you want. I don't know. And then... Where else? Crew quarters, brig bridge. Okay. And you can get out in your spacesuit, but I would not recommend that right now, because you don't know if these people are going to leave. That would be bad. That would be really bad. But anyway. Yeah, that's the game, and I can't wait to like play this more. Alright, now we're moving at a high speed. <clears throat> Let's look at on the map. 
I don't know where we're going. It's pretty interesting. So, these hexagons are huge. They're bigger than just what you see. You can actually, like, keep going and it'll expand. But it's hard to explain. It won't expand into the next hexagon. It's because these are connected through these, like, um, wormholes and stuff. But I'm stuck on the game right now because I have to get there and I cannot. I don't know how to. I'm, like, trying to plant some sort of spy uh, thing in someone's ship. But, you know, if you have two ships and you hire two pilots, then you have a little group of ships you can get more and more and hire marines and engineers and other personnel. You can just walk around hiring people. And I kind of wanted to go to that space station, but they left. I guess these guys are miners. What does this guy do? Hello. Where can I find... Sending you information now. Anyway, it's not like Dwarf Fortress where the people are like uh, really complex, but maybe someday they'll have that. And my ship's around here somewhere. And another cool thing you can do is this. When you land, you can put it into internal storage. And then get it later. So one day, maybe I'll get one of these ships. Anyway, there you go. It's a cool game. I think I heard something about it being multiplayer. I can't be sure. That would be so good.